Welcome to Good Living by Design. I'm Lenor Gonzalez. Today we'll be updating, exploring new options, and taking care of our homes. Join us as we show you how photography can enhance the design of your home or office. Then we'll show you how to update your kitchen with new hardware. Then we'll stop by Bessel Tapas and Wine Bar. We also have tips from a local realtor on how to pre-qualify for your loan, as well as advice on homeowners insurance needs. Then we'll tackle some handyman tasks with a pro. We'll end the show with our fitness advisor showing us how to eat healthy every day. All this today on Good Living by Design. Photographs are some of our most valuable possessions, and like most of us, we have them throughout our home and typically hanging on our walls. I wanted to bring you a few ideas today that can help you use some of them in different spaces that don't take up so much room. To start off with, um, there are a lot of unique companies out there now that can take your photographs and transition them into wonderful pieces. And here I have a couple coasters with photographs, family photographs, and those are great to lay around the house and um, don't take up wall space. Another great idea is to not always think about hanging your photographs flat on the wall. But here we have a, a beautiful photograph um, on an easel. And that's another great way that you can use some of your surface area and again, save some of your wall space. Another great idea that I do with my family on an annual basis and create gifts for my family is put all your photographs for that year in review in a nice bound book. There's so many different companies out there that can offer this to you at very inexpensive prices. It's a great way to review your annual photos and see what happened for that year. And my most favorite tip for you today is take a bowl out of anywhere in your home. It can be in your kitchen or a decorative bowl that you have lying around and put in your loose photographs. We never know what to do with those kid photos or the pictures that friends and family send you. This makes a great conversational piece if you put it on an ottoman or your coffee table in your home. Now let's see how photography can affect your interior design and your offices. My name is Thomas Cooper with Lightbox Images. We're at the historic art district on South Pearl Street at Gallery 1505. Lightbox Images was uh, brought out as a business from my photojournalism career and it's a collection of some of my fine artwork that has appeared in many different galleries throughout the Denver area. We offer up a lot of different uh, images from wildlife to landscapes to more contemporary type pieces. They're printed and mounted on different kinds of forms of medium. We have uh, different gallery type mounts where we mount to hardboard or we mount to canvas and uh, we do canvas stretches or we do um, framed pieces like this. Um, we've also started mounting to uh, acrylic which really brings out uh, the, the kind of the pop of color in different images. I like to go really large with images. Um, I feel like a lot of the houses today have a lot of big wall space and uh, I'd like to fill up a lot of that wall space with you know large prints that really stand out. Beans, uh, one of my best sellers, the, the birds. Um, it's an award-winning photo that was printed on canvas in black and white, which offers a really contemporary type piece that uh, kind of fits any home decor. My assistant and I like to come out and look at um, a particular place, home, or business and see what would work within that. Um, I work with a lot of my customers dealing in whether looking for more of a wildlife theme, a nature theme, or something more contemporary. Uh, similar to the old rustic railroad photo that I have here. Um, we like to look at the, the color of the decor and see kind of like uh, what would fit um, according to the wall color and whatnot and uh, whether we're looking at more of a traditional type frame piece with glass and frame um, to more of a more contemporary type piece like this one mounted on hardboard. It's uh, printed on canvas which kind of gives it a nice feel to it. Um, we can also mount acrylic over the top of that, which again brings out and enhances a lot of the colors in it. Choosing the photo for a particular space, I first sit down with the client and I ask them what kind of feel they're looking for in their decor and what they want to have an end product. And we look through a gallery of endless images that we can put together and then we can custom build that piece for their particular home. Case in point, uh, the bird picture, it, it kind of feels it is a contemporary piece, so it kind of goes with a lot of decor, um, but yet it's still a wildlife piece, so it kind of uh, fits both mediums. We provide 
an assortment of custom work to fit today's modern homes, as well as state-of-the-art frame pieces to fit your decor. Contact Lightbox Images so we can set up an appointment to come out to your office or home to find a piece that'll fit best for you. Coming up next, we'll visit with Julio Escobar of Beso Tapas and Wine Bar. Find videos, information, and expert interior design advice at goodlivingbydesign.com. Decor New is a full-service interior design company. We're located in Highlands Ranch, and we've been here in Colorado for 10 years. Usually the kind of clients that contact us are pretty busy. They don't have a lot of time to do this on their own, um, and they just want to have someone come into their home and make it feel the way they envision it. We pride ourselves on working with all kinds of budgets and being able to make someone comfortable when we come in their home, and it's a great experience. It should be fun. It shouldn't be stressful or overwhelming. With the core and use design expertise, knowledge, and attention to detail, people can save money because they avoid costly mistakes and they also avoid wasting time. Our process usually starts with a 20-minute phone call and that's our discovery phase where we learn more about your project, what you want to do in the space, and what your expectations are. We'll then make an in-home consultation where we actually then go and see your space and sit down um, for about an hour and uh, measure the space, take photographs of the space. Then we go back to our office and in two weeks we come back with a design presentation. This is when we show you three design options. All our design options are interchangeable. You can mix and match and they were created based on conversations we had with you. Once you've selected the design option that you'd like to do in your home, we go back to our office and start the ordering process. We're there to manage your project from start to finish. We do everything in your home, from a simple paint consultation, to accessorizing a room, to decorating one room or your whole home. We do it all. Call Decor on You now and get $250 off your interior design project, 303-346-2593. Interact with Good Living by Design on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Find the links at goodlivingbydesign.com. Hi, I'm Elena Anderson with the Decor and You branch of Three Week Kitchens. I have a great tip for a way to update the look of your kitchen with very little expense. And that tip is change your cabinet hardware. Cabinet hardware is an often underappreciated element of kitchen design, but changing the handles on your cabinets can have a huge impact on the overall style and look of your kitchen. If you're going for a contemporary look, choose simple shapes, such as a round or straight handle in a shiny finish like chrome shown here. For a more traditional feel, check out a more detailed decorative design. You can do knobs or handles, often in antique bronze or a brushed nickel finish. And a recent development on the Finnish market in handles is matte gold. That's become increasingly popular and is great for transitional kitchens, those that fall between contemporary and traditional styles. Generally, cabinet hardware updating is extremely inexpensive and it's an easy step you can take to update your kitchen's look immediately. If you were looking for some professional design help with a kitchen or bathroom modeling project, please contact the Decor and You branch of Three Week Kitchens in Highlands Ranch. You can find us at 303-346-2593 or check out the website at threeweekkitchens.com. My colleagues and I would love to help you design the kitchen and bath of your dreams. Beso is kiss in Spanish. Julio and Beth Escobar opened the restaurant in early 2014. The small plates allow you to share and sample the menu. Because they're family owned and operated, the moment you step in the restaurant, you feel at home and welcome. Let's go check out Beso Tapas and Wine Bar and see what else they have to offer. Hi, I'm Julio Escobar of Beso Tapas and Wine Bar. We have developed a menu which uh, intrigues people because it's, uh, it's unique and, uh, and while it's tapas, it has a flair of a Mediterranean and also a little bit of Latin uh, uh, flavors in there as well. Uh, it's all made from scratch. The sauces, the, uh, uh, everything that gets cured, even the mozzarella cheese that we have in this uh, pizza or flatbread, we call it. Uh, which is fresh mozzarella with uh, uh, Roma tomatoes, balsamic vinegar, and, uh, and a little bit of basil. Uh, 
all is fresh, also made in-house, uh, including the flatbread. Also the empanadas, we make the empanadas, the pork, uh, the uh, beef and the mushroom with uh, cheese. Again, all is made by hand in-house. Uh, the piquillo queso, we uh, actually uh, infused our own uh, balsamic vinegar and our uh, honey is, uh, is, is actually uh, infused with a little bit of uh, lavender, so it has a nice little toasty flavor and lavender essence to it. Uh, the fried avocado is, uh, is just delicious. Again, it's all uh, made in-house and uh, has a little bit of goat cheese and a delicious maple sauce with uh, onions and tomatoes. And, uh, and of course, we have the, uh, the one and only, uh, we just uh, came out with this a couple of, a few months ago, and it's been one of the, uh, the probably the highlights of our dessert, which is the uh, uh, chocolate pincho, so chocolate balls with a little bit of marshmallow and chocolate and, uh, and caramel sauce. Again, all delicious, all homemade, and there's so much more that we make in-house. Uh, our pork belly is cured over uh, almost for a week in Miro uh, Pie. It gets cooked overnight, and the next day we cut in cubes. We toss it in a, a little bit of salt, and uh, coarse salt and powdered sugar. Uh, and get served with a couple of aiolis and patatas bravas. Amazing. Uh, so uh, from the sangria that we make also in-house, both the white and the red sangria, is, is, uh, is one of the items that people keep coming back for. We, you know, we have a great happy hour that they went through these items uh, throughout the whole week. And, uh, and by weekly or weekly sometimes, we change the menu on the boards, uh, which is, uh, uh, again, uh, part of the excitement that people are you know, always looking forward. The wines, uh, we do meet with our wine purveyors uh, by a couple of times a month, and uh, we go over some of the, some of the wines that they may be available uh, seasonally. Uh, some of the wines that we uh, specialize in is actually the Garnachas and the Tempranillos out of Rioja, Spain. But we also have some Chileans and, uh, and some great Argentinian wines, like the uh, Colomé Torontes or Filos Torontes. Uh, again, amazing wines. Uh, that, uh, that we always looking for the DNA between the food and the, uh, and the wines themselves. So if, if you come to, uh, to our place, uh, very likely I'll be kind of trying to drive you towards some wines because I want to make sure that you're getting the best experience out of all of it between the, the, uh, the food preparation in the back of the kitchen and the wines that we actually have available. Please come and see us at Beso. We are family owned, we love kids. We actually have a great kids menu with hot dogs and sliders and uh, it has a great mac and cheese in it, so it's just delicious. Uh, but also we are very humble uh, uh, establishment. We, we know that we cannot be here without the support and the love of the uh, locals. And that's been one of our biggest uh, heartwarming experience that we have so many people that come to us. Uh, we have created this uh, base of clientele that they just love to come to this place and again come to see us at Beso. We, uh, we are located at 32 West Springle Drive uh, here in Highlands Ranch and, uh, and Beth and I uh, uh, and our staff would love to see you again and again. Cheers. Up next we'll get tips from a local realtor on pre-qualifying for a loan. Find videos, information, and expert interior design advice at goodlivingbydesign.com. Hi, I'm Kelsey, and we're here at Apricot Lane Boutique at the Streets at South Glen. So we are a women's boutique. We're great for women anywhere from 18 to 60. We've got a great assortment of clothes from skirts, tops, dresses, handbags, jewelry, accessory, great gift ideas. So come on down to Streets at South Glen and come shop with us. We'd love to have you here. Her Life Denver magazine is designed to keep women inspired and connected. Each month, we dedicate Her Life to celebrating all that is exceptional in our community. You'll find inspirational women and interesting topics such as health, beauty, and home design. With beautiful full-color photography and great stories, we strive to keep today's women connected to the things they need and want. Get our free monthly newsletter or subscribe by going online at herlifemagazine.com forward slash Denver. Hi, this is Brooke Hengst. I'm with the Madison & Company Live Colorado team. Uh, in this market, things are moving really fast. So for buyers, there's really an importance on getting pre-qualified for your mortgage. This is ultimately your first step in putting the financial pieces of the puzzle together and knowing really what your shopping limit is all about. 
So if you need any uh, recommendations for mortgage brokers, I have several in town that I work with regularly. You can reach me at sellwithbrook.com or 720-988-5952. Hi, I'm Linda O'Brien. I'm one of the designers on the Decor New team. And one of the things that clients come to us asking us about is color. A lot of our houses are designed that the rooms join together, especially with the open spaces. So I always suggest using one common color and keeping it neutral so that you can bring in all other colors through fabrics and textures and stuff. So some of the places that you can look, I have a color fan here, is whites. Whites are a great way to start, um, to use on a wall color. It's a great neutral. You also have the grays here. That's another good palette to work with. And then you have what's called our warm neutrals here. All these colors are from the Sherwin-Williams deck. So you can go down to your Sherwin-Williams stores and they have the whites as well as the grays as well as the warm neutrals all displayed out. And just so you can see how they work, here I have one of the colors pulled for a main wall color. And you can see here how you can bring color in with all different types of fabric. So just because your wall color is neutral doesn't mean you can't have color in a space. Here is another great example using kind of an off-white and you can see how the fabrics go really well. Now we're going to visit with Michelle Young of Handyman Matters where she is going to show us how to do repairs and maintenance on our home. Well, I'm Michelle Young and I'm the owner of Handyman Matters of Cherry Creek. We are a uh, locally owned and operated uh, franchise. We provide a, a wide array of services. We will do something as small as change a light bulb and we will do something as large as remodel your kitchen or bathroom. A lot of common issues that we get or projects that we provide for people's homes are drywall patch and repair, um, interior painting, but we also have been getting a lot of requests for deck building um, and uh, as well as remodeling for kitchens and bathrooms, we do, we do a lot of services for those as well. It's just providing that peace of mind and that stress relief to our customers when they call, they know that they're going to be taken care of. We warranty our work for a year. We have insurance, we're bonded and insured. Our craftsmen are background checked, so they know when they come to your door, you can trust us and we're gonna take care of you. And if there is any issues, we will come and correct those issues. Our craftsmen have at least, bare minimum, 10 years of experience in the field, but most of our guys have over 20 years of experience. And they've seen everything. And they have to know everything about the tasks that they're gonna do because when they go to the home, they're going to need to address the issue, fix the problem, but also a lot of times there, there is like a to-do list that the customer has, the things have been piling up and breaking over time and finally they would like to address these issues and while we're there we'd like to go ahead and take a look at any of the projects that you have on hand. Let's say we go out to um, tile your floor or your wall in your bathroom and then you say, you know what, my faucet's leaking, can you take a look at that? We would be happy to take a look at that and we can fix that the same day. Typically, our customers call because they are tired of waiting for a spouse to get to a task because we all have busy lives. We have long work weeks and the time we have with our families in the evenings and the weekends, we would like to spend with our families having fun, doing the barbecues, going to the pool, you know, going on vacation. The last thing that some customers want to do is change a garbage disposal or change that light that's really high up that you need a really high ladder to get to. You know, it's, it's just easy to call me. We'll take your appointment. We'll get to it as soon as we can. We'll take care of it. And you know that we're going to do a good job. We're going to do it right. And you don't have to worry about it. And then you have all the time that you want for yourself. If you were to do it yourself, it's going to cost you your time. If you mess it up, now the scope of the work has even changed and it may cost you more money now to fix it if you do mess up. And, you know, most individuals don't carry insurance for liability that they do in their own home. So, you know, you can actually cost yourself more money in the long run unless you are absolutely certain you know what you're doing. Please give me a call if you have any issues and projects that you would like to do in your home. We cover everything from small light bulb changes up to remodels. Our office number is 720-370-8008. Up next, we'll look at ways to keep our families on track with healthy eating. Hi, I'm Lenore. And I'm Jen. And we're here from Decor and You in Highlands Ranch, a full-service interior decorating company. And we have something great to share with you today. It's Decor Room in a Box. 
If you love to shop, the decor room in the box is perfect for you. It allows you to control your own makeover in your own time and still get the advice of a professional designer. It's a fun and easy process and when you get to our website, you click on Virtual Interior Designer and you'll fill out a style questionnaire where you ask questions about your style, taste, provide dimensions, photographs for us, and in four to six weeks, you get a beautiful box back filled with everything you need to execute that design plan. Inside the box, you'll see a custom design that's made especially for you. It comes with a customized design plan that shows you all the furniture items that we specify. It also has the space plan that's drawn to scale. And we'd also have all the items and we'll tell you where everything goes. My favorite part is when the box comes, you get all the goodies inside. We send you everything necessary for your custom look, which includes all of the fabric samples necessary to complete the design and exactly where they go and how much to use. We have our upholstery samples here as well as we always include a paint palette and the color selections for that. And here at Decor New, we like to include wallpaper in our designs and you get the sample as well for that. Also in the box, you'll find the furniture finishes as well as the stain for your furniture. If we specify hardware, you also get the finish of the hardware that you need to use. This is my favorite part. This is our flip book. And this is everything you need from photos of all the items that we specified in your design. And in the back, you'll see the measurements and the colors so that when you go shopping, you have everything that you need to put your room together. That's Decor Room in a Box. We made it easy and fun for you. Go to decorandyouhr.com and click on Virtual Interior Design and order your box today. Hi, I'm Michelle Calazzi with Allstate Insurance, and I'm here to talk to you about how to handle your home after a hailstorm. As you know, hailstorms are very, very prevalent here in Colorado and several storms throughout the year, actually. If your home is destroyed by hail, you really want to contact your agent first and foremost to get advice as how you should proceed. As you know, with the volume, it may be difficult to get in touch with them. So what you can do from your own home to prepare for the claim is to take an inventory of all the things that have been damaged. If you have patio furniture, please take pictures. If there are shingles on the home that you need to get rid of because they're laying around, please take photos of those, take an inventory. Any emergency repairs, if you've got leakage, you can put plastic up on the roof. I caution you to be safe. We don't want our policyholders getting injured trying to maintain the loss before the claim adjuster can come out. Be very careful of who you talk to as far as roofing companies. Get the advice of your agent before you go into contract with any type of roofer. And more than anything, just make sure that your home is protected until we can get there and take care of you. For more information on hail claims, you can contact me at 720-344-0111 or at mcalazy at allstate.com. My name is Laura Gooding and I am the window treatment specialist here at Decor and You. Today's window treatment tip is for the parents of young children as well as pet owners. Think cordless. The manufacturers today of window treatments have are very in tune with this issue and have come up with some great products. For instance, this is a Roman shade and it's cordless. You just operate it by pulling it down and raising it up with your hand. Another great option by design is shutters and you can just obviously operate that as well with your hand. And lastly, motorization is really taking off. Remote controls or some manufacturers actually have apps that you can program your shades to operate when you're not even home. And now our fitness advisors, Heather and Carrie, have some great suggestions for keeping our family on track with healthy eating. Let's check it out. Hello, Heather Socias, Fit Foods for You. I'm here with registered dietitian Carrie Bach with Core Plus Nutrition. And um, if you guys didn't catch the last episode covering fats, be sure to go to Good Living by Design. It was phenomenal. But today we're actually going to be talking about gluten. Gluten-free. What What's the big hype about gluten-free? <laughs> right, right. It's kind of the cure-all right now. Um, and gluten's found in wheat, rye, barley, and then some oats, depending on where those oats are manufactured. And the, the big hype about it is that gluten can exacerbate any existing inflammation in the body for those who may be sensitive to gluten. For those who have a true 
um, allergy to gluten, celiac sprue, mm -hmm. they absolutely cannot have any gluten at all. It, it just wreaks havoc on the GI for them and okay. they aren't absorbing their nutrients. So there's two very distinct kind of gluten-free camps. Those that truly cannot have any gluten at all and those that are you know gluten intolerant, they might feel better when they don't have gluten, um, but they can get away with a little bit. And of course, food manufacturers have really jumped on the gluten-free craze. So there's a ton of mm. gluten-free things out there, but that doesn't mean that those are good for you. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> um, it seems kind of restrictive. It's kind of, kind of a restrictive it really diet. It can so be. How do you, how do they make it, how do you make it fun? Let's right. say I'm like, okay, you're tell me, Heather, you're all gluten-free. Okay, now what? Right. I mean, what am I looking for? What so the main thing, it is restrictive, and it really, a couple of things that you need to keep in mind. You still should focus on whole foods as much as possible. So just because it says gluten-free on the box doesn't mean it's great for you. They use, a lot of food manufacturers will put a lot more sugar, a lot more fats into that product to make up oh. for the fact that it's gluten-free. Carrie, what about rice? Is all rice gluten-free? All rice that's just rice is gluten-free. What? Is if, that, that's a trick question. That's a trick question. <laughs> so all of, you know, this kind of rice, the, the, what's in it, it is organic, brown rice, wild rice, sweet brown rice, and heirloom red rice. It it's is all rice. free. But if there's different seasonings, flavorings, preservatives, that's where we need to, to look um, out. Those things may not be gluten-free. And it gets tricky. I mean, this, this actually does have a gluten-free symbol on it, but not all foods list the GF or have that certification on their um, labels. Okay. And so it's really, you just have to be educated as a consumer to know which grains, so anything that isn't wheat, rye, barley, and then of course we want to see the GF on the oats to make sure that those are gluten free. So all of these meals are excellent choices. First of all, they're whole food based, which is fantastic. There aren't a lot of different types of sauces and the herbs and seasonings that are used are just that. They aren't adulterated with any strange preservatives or anything. And all fruits and vegetables are gluten free, as are meats without those extra preservatives. So this would be a great choice for those who are gluten intolerant. Tolerant. So these would all fall into a good source of gluten-free. But I, I do have to say that um, Fit Foods For You is not in a certified gluten-free kitchen. Um, ideally, we'll be headed that direction. Carrie, if somebody would like to reach out to you for a personal consultation, what would be the best way to do that? The best way would be through our website at coreplus.com, core spelled with a K. And we do, we're, we're in northern Denver, East Boulder County area, but we do also offer consultations throughout the state of Colorado. Thank you so much for joining us today. Absolutely, thank you. I hope you enjoyed the show. Thank you to Thomas Cooper with Lightbox Images, Elena Anderson, Three Week Kitchens, Michelle Calaisi, Allstate Insurance, Michelle Young with Handyman Matters, Brooke Hanks of Madison & Company Properties, Julio Escobar with Beso Tapas & Wine Bar, and our fitness advisors, Heather Susias and Carrie Back. I'm Lenore Gonzalez. Thank you for watching Good Living by Design. Now, let's take a look at, let me do this part over. <laughs> I goofed up that last part. So this is uh, one of the places, oops, somebody's coming in. Photographs play an important part in our lives. They capture those special moments and they are most of our best. So it kind of had a feel of what the zebra's fur would be like, um, or pelt. I mean, let me start back over. Do I call it pelt? <laughs>